Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Eeyore, and this is Fantasy Maiden War Scarlet. I feel like doing another session, so let's go ahead and get that over. Uh, you know, done with. Um, let's see, we've already done our wife- I forgot about our grace points. I had 140 grace points on Ra Rayma. I've already spent it on Predict, which increases her accuracy and evasion by 10, when her power is above three, uh, 130, which shouldn't be too difficult for her to pull off. Um, with Keen, I got her unfocused movements, which increases the power of her P attacks, which is um, which is her headbutt and her little sword attack, and um, it also increases her movement range. It only increases it by um, a quarter of a point, though, so it's not going to do anything for a while. Um, Yomu d only had 40 grace points. Uh, what I probably will t do for her is probably do. Um, unfocused movement as well, since that's what uh, helps her out. And Rumia has no points to spend whatsoever. Um, prob supposedly Tipsy's a good thing to get for her, simply because her, her strongest move requires, um, requires 105 power, so she can right off the bat use her strongest attack. But I don't know. Um, other than that, let me take a quick look at... Okay, it did. It increased her um, her two her two uh, P attacks are now 50 points stronger, which is pretty good. So no worries there. Okay, let's go ahead and get this going. Once again, I haven't done this battle. I've I've read up a little bit on it. It shouldn't be bad. I think we actually have infinite time in it, which is kind of nice. We'll see how it goes. Next map. Path to the shrine. Thump thump. Hmm. Where did Luna go? I can't find her anywhere. You're not going to. Uh, you're not going to either. My hiding spot is is perfect this time. I've dug this hole waiting for a day. Uh, I dug this hole waiting for a day like this to come. There's no way someone like you can see through it, Sunny. Hmm. She's not anywhere around. Maybe I'll go take a look at Blake again. Ha! I win. Or not? Yeah. Go. Found you, Luna. Hey, <laughs> hey. I bet you are thinking that I'd never find you, right? Wait, how did you find me? I thought I hid per myself perfectly. I, I even used my power to hide my sounds to make sure. Stupid, hiding your sounds means nothing if you stick this, uh, stick this here for everyone to see. What do you mean? Oh, you mean that flag I used to mark the hole? I was worried that the hiding spot was so perfect I wouldn't be able to find it. Uh huh. And seeing your face on that flag made it obvious that you were here. Why, what are you two doing here? That hole would be a tight fit for both of you. Ah, oh, that's no good. Star, you're supposed to uh, you're not supposed to show yourself. I'm one of the seekers today, so you need to hide until I find you. I'm already tired of it. I always know where the seekers are by using my power. And the other seeker already went off somewhere. I'm saying even though you're the seeker, you went and took an afternoon nap. Oh, how did you find out? I can sense your movements, and I was bored, so I wanted to check up on you. Is it just me, or have you gotten more sly than usual for a while now? That doesn't matter. I've found something more interesting. The Shrine Maiden and some others seem to be flying towards the mountain. The Shrine Maiden? You mean the one for the shrine? Uh-huh. Flying through this mist is just asking, asking to be pranked, right? I get it. Since we're tired of hide and seek, let's go prank the Shrine Maiden. Oh, where'd Luna go? Or, oh, jeez, I'm here. You're sitting on top of me. Oh, so you are. So, uh, so you are. I was wondering where you went. You're the one who jumped on me. I couldn't get out because of your, because your butt is so huge. What? It's more because you're slower than anything. Now, now, calm down, you two. The Shrine Maiden will leave if we don't hurry. Yeah, that's true. Okay, Star, show us where to go. Animal Trail. There are many different interpretations of the very essence and meaning of yokai. In short, yokai were originally a logical existence, and the ultimate effect of the boundary of illusion and substance was to... Is that so? Hey, are you listening properly? I'm not done yet. Eh? You're right, it's the Shrine Maiden and some other humans. Isn't that blonde a yokai? I thought the Shrine Maiden was really tough on yokai. What's she doing with them? I can't hear them clearly, Sonny. Get a bit closer to them. Roger, don't go too far from me though. I won't be able to hide you two other uh, hide you two otherwise. 
I was not expecting a lecture to really begin on, our, on the way. Her lecturing is accurate and, and all, but it's too, it's too long. It's uh, not getting in my head even though I'm listening. There's no way a yokai could understand anything from it. It is said that sufficient rain will eventually wear a stone down. The repetition actually works quite well to get uh, others to remember something. You think yokai would ever reform themselves? For them, in one ear, out the other is the more appropriate idiom. I can understand w wanting to teach them, but I think it's better to let them be. But leaving the matter to rest could, would cause harm for humans, would it not? Uh-huh. That's what yokai are all about. The king isn't telling them to stop attacking humans. The most important thing is maintaining a good balance. I have not studied enough. I do not understand that, how that would lead to harmony. It's not something you can understand just by thinking about it. You haven't talked to yokai much, have you? No, I have not. I do not come to the world of, living, of the living very often. I have spoken with ghosts, but I have not communicated with living yokai before. This is a good opportunity, then. Watch closely. Save me. I don't want to want to be lectured anymore. Ow. What? Hey, those humans are just, uh, are just standing there. Go do something about them instead. Why would I do anything with them? Naughty children are the ones who need to be punished hundredfold. Eek, please stop. Well, not quite what you imagined, right? <laughs> that may be tr uh, may well be true. When I look, uh, look at situations like these, it makes me think that they are not as dangerous as I thought. Hey, don't ignore me. Why not? You should be grateful that Keen is taking the time to lecture you. If you follow her teachings, you could become a true yokai after all. So uncaring. It might be prudent to be careful from here on, though. It is difficult to see at the moment. There are, may well be enemies surrounding us. Hmm, that's true. I got a bit too engrossed in my lecture. I suppose that will have to do. I'll save, save the lecture for later. Phew! I know your intuition is good, but sorry for making you lead the way. I'm the one who said I'd do it to begin with. Just follow after me. Where are we heading towards? If we continue in this direction for the time being, we will we'll soon arrive at the, the Misty Lake and Yokai Mountain. I guess we're heading towards something suspicious. We'll know when we get there. You're like a compass without a dial. Hey, hey, why are you all flying around like this anyway? Oh yes, we never did tell y Rumi about it. Our objective is to find the source of the Scarlet Mist and put an end to it. You saw how Akio is faring, correct? Yokai such as yourself may be relatively unaffected, but to humans the mist is like poison. Uh, but it's so pleasant when sunlight can't get through. And what should I do anyway? Eh? Y'all will get angry if I run away, but it's boring just doing nothing. That is true. I doubt you would be much help in terms of reasoning or theory crafting either. I suppose you can just help with defeating the bad guys. Ah, I see. So I help out when, when we're playing Tamaku. Indeed. When we find the evil ones, we will be sure to inform you. I'm not entirely sure, but they seem to have tamed that yokai. Yeah, it's hard to imagine that she's the shrine maiden of, the, of a shrine. Who knows, maybe shrine maidens capture a guy when they're running low on food. I bet she's fattening her up to eat her, and her next target will be us. Geez, stop that, you're giving me the shivers. I've been feeling eyes on me for a while now. Maybe I've been cursed by the shrine maiden. You two are exaggerating, there's no one better than us at hide and seek after all. I really, really do feel that gaze on me, my spine feels all chilly and... Eat! Sunny, behind you. What's wrong with you, t uh, with you two? What's behind? Yeah! What? Did you just- I just hear a scream. Wait, Luna, didn't I tell you to hide our sounds? I was so frightened I stopped. That eyeball was flying right at us. Let's run away for now. Wh what is all that noise? Rayma, we are surrounded by yokai I have not seen before. What is the meaning of this? Could this be related to the Scarlet Mist? What is this bunch doing here? Reimu, you know about these yokai? Yes, they were fodder that I dealt with pre during the previous incident. It's a bit unnatural for these to appear by themselves, though. Hey, there's a yokai over there. She's wearing a red dress and holding a scythe. A red dress and a scythe? That appears to be the case. Reimu, that one may be the boss. Let's give chase. Hee <laughs> hee, the Damaku battle is beginning, I see. I'll be collecting some good information from this. go. Shamiru, the god of wind. Also, something to note about Rumia is her, uh, supposedly her, like, her class or 
rank or whatever goes up during uh, while well, she's in darkness. So she gets stronger at nighttime. Not sure what that means though. That was a painful experience. At least I got the parasol back safely. But I bet I'm going to be ordered right back to work once I get back. Hmm, I kind of want to take a detour, but oh well. I'll go straight home. I've got to do my best. Hmm, that's... Alright, we can uh, pick whoever we want. Of course, it doesn't really matter who, because we can just, you know, pick these guys. Alrighty. Eek! There she is. It is the Gyokai in a dress with a scythe. So she's the boss of these beasts. We'll get get rid of you, no questions asked. This is how you, they beat me up before, huh? What? Boss? Who the heck are, are you all? No, wait. Hmm, I feel like I've seen that one somewhere before. I've heard nothing about a yokai like that from the villagers. Aren't you that shrine maiden from a while back? I don't. Th I didn't think I'd meet you again. Both you and that magician looked like normal humans, yet... Geez, this is the second time already. That's right, you're... Prepare yourself. Gah! Geez, my name is Ellie. If you forgot about me, just be honest instead of pretending you might know. Ah, Ellie, yeah, it was something like that. And, and who do you think you are? Don't don't expect me to remember every single yokai's name. Wow, they just they just met and Rainbow is already getting angry at the victim whoa. <laughs> and Rainbow is already getting angry at the victim. This is what I get for doing multiple recordings in the morning. They're both being antagonistic to me. Did you meet her before, Eremu? Yes, it was before the spell uh, card rules became popular. In other words, this is a from Toho one through or Toho two through five, I believe, which is on the P for the PC ninety eight. Yes, that was before the spell card rules became popular. But the Gensokyo then is a bit different from the world now. What are you doing here? I was planning on heading straight back, but this is an understandable ex exception. I was waiting for the chance to get revenge on you and that magician. Magician, you must be referring to Marissa. Did you get revenge on her? Or, well, you got beaten to a pulp, huh? I couldn't help it, I couldn't help it. It's been so long since I last fought. Anyway, I won't lose this time. Let's do this, I'll send you packing. Alright. Victory condition, defeat Ellie. Um, defeat. All enemies defeated. Uh, that doesn't sound right. Alright, so all right, we have to defeat Ellie, but not defeat all the enemies. And then the bonus is to defeat ten or more enemies. Okay, um, let's go ahead and take a quick look at our spirit thing. I don't know what custom is. Can't look it up there. Recover 30% of units max HP. Well, I'll go ahead and save. Oh, okay, okay, I see. This is from, this custom is for the uh, the WP abilities we have now. That's a lot of monsters. Right now, there's not even. Um, we need to kill what ten of them or something? Yeah, we need to kill ten or more. All right, let's go ahead and use your um, spirit ability. Since she's now officially a party member, I'll happily uh, kill things with her. And then... So let's move out. Split image ghosties. Oh yeah, we're fighting ghosties. Ghosties are from the PC-98 era as well. Slash first, think later. Called that. Hey, she leveled up. She now has parry level three. Nifty. We can now pull up her his stats. Um, okay, split image ghosties. Well, this is stronger attack. It's not a uh, strike attack. I keep saying S means slash, but it actually means strike, which means it's a physical attack. Let's go ahead and move you out. Off. 
but the Ghosties have uh, only close range attacks, so fighting them from a distance would actually be an advantage. ghosts along with those eyeballs. What should we do? Hide until the Dalmaka battle is over? That's kind of annoying, but I guess this isn't the right atmosphere for pranks. Oh? What's up, Star? There's someone hiding in, the, in that grove of trees. Maybe it's a fairy who didn't get away in time. She, sh she could have gotten lost while playing hide-and-seek too, maybe. Yeah, that's worrying. Let's go take a look. at its 7% chance. Really? Well, oh, so much of that. That was kind of waste. I can't believe I missed with a 93% hit chance. Oh well. Well, that's the end of this turn. Heal ourselves, that's not a big deal. 
this will get her some experience, I should need. I just like how Rainbow is like unhittable at the at this point. Goodbye. That was a bit of overkill. Received, received a bomb. Hmm. They seem to be distracted by a strange yokai. The shrine maiden encounters suspicious eyeball yokai upon departing the shrine. It's not going to be an easy ride. Hmm. The article and the Damaka are both too plain. This won't even make page 3. I'm sure they won't lose, but I guess I'll watch a bit longer. There she is, on the second highest branch. I can't see, her, see clearly, but the shape looks nothing like a fairy. She's muttering to herself and jotting something in her book. What's she up to? I guess the best way is to ask her directly. The Shrine Maiden doesn't seem to differentiate between yokai and humans. She dresses both normally, I see. Excuse me, what are you doing there? Whoa, whoa, who was that? Hmm, there's some fuss going going on over there. I can see someone there. Is that a human? Aye, aye, aye. I, I seem to have been spotted thanks to you all. What business would you have to pop out in front of me all so suddenly? Business? Er, well, we were just wondering what you were hiding there for. Do read, uh, do learn to read the atmosphere, please. Fairies are always so blissfully unaware. Who's there? Show yourself. It might be the yokai reinforcements. We should be cautious. If that's the case, we'll just get rid of them. Oh dear, I guess there isn't any point in hiding it now that I've been found out. I suppose I will give them a proper greeting while I'm here. There you are, Yokai. Good afternoon, everyone. It is a pleasure to meet you. I am Aya Sh Shamimaru, a crow tingu and newspaper reporter. I am honored to have caught your attention. Please feel free to read a copy of this. Bun Bun Maru newspaper, Gensokyo's fastest and most fantastic fountain of truth. Ah, a crow tingu. Newspaper reporter. Yeesh, that sounds like a really bad combination. You should save your surprise looks as well. There are three others still present. Uh, does she mean... I am referring to you three, of course. Now, now, do please... Do show yourselves, if you please. Uh, are you calling out to us because you're mad? My, of course not. However, since you spoiled my pursuit of information, I'll be taking something more interesting in return. In other words, take this. Dwa! Those are fairies. It, uh, those are fairies, it appears. What a strange combination. Those three are just some remar uh, unremarkable prank-loving fairies. They were probably hiding themselves in order to play some trick on us. But no, you've got it wrong. We're innocent. Those fairies are pretty daring to join forces with the Tingu. Surely you jest. Those fairies have nothing to do with me. I am merely a reporter who puts her heart and soul into collecting information. What? <laughs> so fast. It is the duty of a reporter to be honest and modest. My motto is to be sincere to those who offer potential material. Huh? If that's the case, then write an article about these people. They abduct yokai and force them into slavery. Ah, my deepest condolences. However, you should not uh, should report criminals to the police, not to the not to a newspaper reporter. Y you demon! Nope, I am a tinku. So who the heck are you? Enemy or ally? I am ally I ally myself with no one. If you really want an answer, you should call me an ally of the truth. Then don't get involved. This battle has nothing to do with you. Oh, of course I would refrain from such unrefined activities. I'm only here to collect information on the Scarlet Mist. Though I suppose a picture of you in the jaws of defeat would be nice to have. What does a pigeon tingu like you know? You think you're so great. I'll take you out along with this bunch. There we go. Eek, she's going for us too. Please wait, we're innocent bystanders. You peered uh, with that Tingo, so I'll punish you all together, uh, all together with her. That's just crazy. 
Hey, you. Stop making our, our amount of enemies increase. Oh, am I not giving you more of a chance to show your skills? If you do your best, you might even make the cover page you know. Ha, huh, as if. Your newspaper will be suspended due to reporter illness from tomorrow onwards. Oh dear, are you challenging me? You have not been in Kentucky for long, I presume. Allow me to educate you a little on how, just how powerful the Tingu are. Alright. Tingu Gale Bullets. So yeah, these are, I guess you can call them neutral units. Though I don't think you can fight them. Pretty much we can leave them alone, they can handle themselves, but... We probably want to uh, kill them so we can meet the special requirement. Her speed is truly amazing. My eyes are only just catching up to her now. Absolutely, those Tingo are certainly something. You okay pretty much run the full spectrum, and you're on the other end. What's that supposed to mean? It's, it seems that she will defeat all of the enemies first if we dilly-dally. Anything that makes our job easier sounds good to me. Maybe we should just go on and, ahead and let her handle this. Of course we can't. Keep saying things like that and your main character position will be stolen. Ooh, that would be bad. Oh well, let's head on in. We aren't going to lose to her. Okay. So... Let's go ahead and use your spirit ability. We're gonna go ahead and do increased movement. Yes, I can. Just barely. That's right, I'm stealing your kill. Actually, first I'm gonna save. Cause I don't wanna be chipped. What I'll probably do is keep that save there, and then if I have to redo this fight, I'll just continue from that point. But I'll do that off screen. Sprite battle. With my luck, I'm gonna probably miss. <laughs> oh, good. Stole your kill. I'm a little concerned about the uh, the uh, defeat requirement though, so I don't I don't know what to think of it, <laughs> to be honest. Especially if I keep missing with like a ten percent with a, you know a ten percent miss rate. Oh well. I mean, I could have done had a higher chance if I stayed out of the Dalmaku, but I'm trying to push in so I can get this done faster. There we go. Okay, some more level ups. And some more movement. Let's end our turn. Alright, they're just evading. I shouldn't take this too easily. Looks like they don't want to fight back. Hey, let's get out of here as soon as possible. Yeah, but the site that site yokai is waiting at the bottom of the mountain. Oh right, let's go to the shrine. The shrine maiden won't be there, so we can uh, be up to as much mischief as we like. Ah, I see. It's a good idea, Sunny. That's decided then. Let's set off for the shrine. Our destination is over there. Even if you get beat up, keep going. Steal another kill. Of course, she has no. She has 8,000 HP, so she has no real issues about fighting these guys. So, can I actually attack these? No, I cannot. Yeah, I can't attack them. and kill this guy. Yeah. 
Maybe I'm supposed to kill him, um, win this match before the uh, these guys, uh, the fairies, get to uh, the shrine. We'll see. It's really kind of unclear. Pretty sure that wouldn't have been enough if I had enough upgrade or attack. to another level. 378. You know what, level... 7. Okay. What do you taste like?
safe play from here. at this point, just in case. I'm a little, like I said, I'm a little concerned about that defeat requirement. Well, all enemies defeated means we get defeated. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> I really don't. So I guess I'll leave a ghosty alive. I don't know. It's, it's just so weird. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it means that the neutral people, but I can't really say. Okay, got the bonus uh, WP. Fancy seal requires focus movement. Okay. In this case, we're gonna go ahead and move in. our invasion and accuracy by 30. That'd be a close range. You're honestly incomprehensible. Why would you purposely show yourself just so we can defeat you? Hmm? What are you staring at? You're wearing a skirt now, and you're... You're showing off your armpits. When did Shrymania start attempt, uh, attempting to be seductive? What? You've grown a bit too. I guess you've hit puberty by now, huh? This is the close of the Huckery Shrine Maiden. It has nothing to do with my interest. My, is that so? Whose interest would it that be then? Yeah, she had a different outfit as well. And I think her hair was purple and not black back in the PC-98 era. Grief, your speed is on a completely different level. My, my, did you just notice that now? I have a lesson from uh, yours truly. The Tingu are the fastest yokai in Yukin Sokyo. They rule Yokai Mountain and are one of the pivots in the balance of power on Gensokyo. Hey, wait, I don't care about the situation of yokai in Gensokyo today. I have enough worries of my own. Work has been really harsh on me. My allowance is too small. I don't have enough to do a decent amount of shopping. Having my opponent start grumbling is a little off-putting. I can kind of sympathize you with uh, with you though. At least you can see her other attack. She throws her scythe. It actually hits. Wow. Alright, once again, I'm gonna go ahead and save. Because I want to... I mean, I'm obviously gonna win this turn. So I kinda wanna see if I can, uh, 
kill the uh, the ghost and the other thing. If it doesn't work, I can I can just load and go from there. Let's hope it's a typo. Hogging up all the uh, the grays and um, experience with Reimu, but I mean she's the main character. I thought you were nothing to write home about. I couldn't help it. I couldn't help it. My four tiles were blown away earlier. Uh, four tiles. I'm going to restock on them and show you who's boss next time. I won't forget this. Got a lot of experience, grays, and points. And level 10. And nothing new. And we get Ginjo Saki. Alright, you two. Now's our chance. Now then, all the unwelcome guests, guests appear to be gone. Yep, that's about it. My main character role has been successfully protected. What are you talking about? Thank you for your assistance. We finished up here quickly due to your help. Oh, no need to thank me. I was doing what I wanted to after all. But if you truly wish to show your appreciation, you could always read my newspaper. Ah, that's fine. I only read Gensokia Finance myself. My, those defense mechanisms activate, uh, activated quickly. You still should try it. My newspaper comes with a free bottle of detergent currently. Oh, by the way, do you have a moment? Yes, may I help you? I heard from Marissa yesterday regarding something about a Tingu. What? That a Tingu was searching for a shrine maiden that isn't me? Eh. That Tingu must be you, right? She mentioned this Buzz Buzz Maro newspaper too. That would be Bun Bun Maro newspaper. Please do not make it sound like an insect. The name doesn't matter, so what's this shrine maiden business all about? Uh, I should be heading back now, or my superiors will get angry. Please excuse me. Hey, what kind of way is that to avoid my question? It certainly wasn't one that took much effort or thought. In any case, there's nothing I can tell you. Until we meet again. Zoom. Whoa, she's super fast. I can't see her already. She comes like the wind and goes like a tempest. That yokai really goes on at her own pace. However, from her behavior, it seems like she does indeed know about the shrine maiden that is not Rima. Try me to that isn't me, huh? Well, whatever. We don't know enough about that, so let's just continue investigating. Yes, we should hurry. Huh? Something the matter? Yeah, I was wondering where those fairies from before went. Did they get beaten up? Maybe. They didn't do anything bad, so who cares what happens to them? Yes, let's hurry. Looks like they left. Looks pretty hairy there for a minute, but we've all made it through somehow. Did you hear what she said? That we didn't do anything bad? He he, that what a stupid shrine made. She doesn't know what we're, that we're heading towards the shrine. Let's get our, uh, going ourselves. Who knows when the shrine maiden will return. What should we do while no one's at the shrine? How about painting all those Daruma dolls' eyes white? We could poke holes in, the, in, in all these sliding doors with our fingers. I somehow think we're starting to go a bit too far. Goodness, fairies never learned their lessons. At least they will not be bothering me now. That was rather close, though. So the Hakuri Shrine Maiden already knows about the other Shrine Maiden. There are still many things about that other Shrine Maiden's actions. They would make anyone suspicious. 
There's no need for outsiders to know too much about uh, such things. Not until her objectives are confirmed, at least. Hopefully Mominji is doing well in shadowing her, but... Oh well, I shall continue my my own following of the Hakari Shrine Maiden. Stage clear. Good, we won. So, got a bunch of points, good, good stuff, let's get it going. Wow, this is going for a very long time. Unfortunately, I'll just leave it on one video. Animal Trail. It is true that we are relying on Reimu to lead in her own way, but the mist is gradually growing thicker. We might be approaching this point of its origin. Indeed, it seems we're making adequate progress after all. That's Reimu's intuition for you. Hey, adequate is pretty good considering how far we can see ahead of us. I suppose you suffer from the reputation of your, infam uh, of your famous intuition, huh? In any case, that was a very strange yokai. What, which do you mean, the scythe yokai or the reporter yokai? Both of them would qualify. Kitsokyo contains so many different kinds of yokai. The Tengu was especially interesting. She called herself an ally of the truth. Yeah, she did say something admiral like that. I would like to try calling some myself something similar too. Perhaps something like I am Yom Yomu Konpaku, the sword that spites falsehoods. That sounds pretty good. Like something you would find from those old stories of samurai and knight. The, you two like that kind of stuff, huh? Anyway, that's enough joking around. The Tengu was strange, but the Scythe Yokai's goal's goal was a complete mystery. Yes, perhaps we may be able to find out something if we follow her. Ah, that's right, this is the direction that the Scythe Yokai ran off towards. Yes, I was thinking this was a bit suspicious anyway. Is that Yokai really connected to this Misto? I do not think it would be particularly unsurprising if she was. Why would that be? That Scythe Yokai mentioned something about restocking as she escaped. Thus, it should be likely that there is a base of sorts some nearby where she can do so. I see, that sounds reasonable. You are more sensible and reliable than I thought. I thought before that you resemble some of the children at my elementary school. They would regularly lose their belongings and such. L lose their belongings? Something wrong? Ah, uh, not at all. I could not possibly have lost my belongings. Arg, I left the notes I took at Akio's house at the shrine this time. Anyway, this mist is getting thicker. Let's keep pro progressing onwards. Hmm, why are you staring at me? Hey, hey, what was your name? I never told you. It's Reimu. Oh, Reimu, huh. Okay, I'll remember it. Reimu, the food you made earlier was really good. Can I come eat it again? Oh, really? You have praiseworthy taste. I prefer humans, but I don't mind helping out if I can keep eating food like that. You think I'll become a cook for a yokai just because you asked me to? Boo. The force is opening up. Looks like that we're going to emerge at the lake. Alright. Well, gain some frame right there. Okay, we got 10,000 points to spend. Uh, wife upgrades, we have 15 points, so can't really do anything with that. We do have a new item. We'll go ahead and take a look at it. Recovers 2,000 HP, consumable. Okay, it's a healing item. Um, Yomu can have it for right now. So we find another use for it. Other than that, um, let's go ahead and take a look at our skills. We've got 60 grays. I can do. I can increase random dodge. I don't think we'll need to though. I'll go ahead and hold on to it for now. As for you, you only have 30 grays. You have 60. Which unfortunately is not enough for what I need her, want her to do. I want her to get um, unfocused movement, so just like um, Keen does. And you only have 20 grays. As you can see, there's a kind of a level difference. <laughs> just a bit. But we'll go ahead and do some more upgrading. Okay, we don't have enough for upgrades. I suppose I can upgrade some of these other characters if I really wanted to. We'll see. For right now, let's go ahead and save the game. And we'll save in uh, this slot. And let's go ahead and suspend. Oh, are you stopping? Good work. Yes, it is rather late. You shouldn't push yourself. 
you might end up having hip pains like me. There really should be someone younger doing this, I suppose. I apologize for having to put up with an old lady like me. Though I've had lots of experiences back when I was a young, uh, was young myself. Ah, uh, I've started rambling again. Sorry for being a bother. See you again. And that, there you go. I'm the depressed you are, and this was Fantasy Maiden War Scarlet. Sorry if this part's going to be exceptionally long, but well, we got another battle done, so take it for what you can. So hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time.